Hi guys, this is Small Couponer. Um, these are the deals for July 28th, 2019 through August uh, 3rd, 2019. I want to come on and let you guys know about this. If you are if you are planning to do the Crest toothpaste deal at Walgreens this week, um, they are on sale for $2.99 and when you buy three, you get a $7 register reward. Um, I want to note that you have to be cautious. Um, do not clip all of your... Um, digitals only clip the ones you're going to use and remove the ones you are not going to use i know you will lose them but if you are planning if you are planning to do that deal um, i would recommend removing all of um, the eight off four if you already ha if you have that clipped and you have not used it yet and remove the um the four off two crest to pay i mean do not remove that one. Um, re only remove the eight off four, and you if you have the um one off uh Crest toothpaste three ounce or more clipped, remove that one as well. Only have um four off two toothpaste clipped, and the two off one Crest 3D white toothpaste clipped. Um, and then remove the other ones, or it will interfere with your um, deal because the lowest volume one will come off first. So the great thing about Walgreens is you could go into your account or your Walgreens app and go to your save coupons and remove them. Right now, I'm on coupons.com app because this is how I'm able to how I'm able to search for all the coupons, even the clip ones. For Walgreens, you cannot search for the um, all your coupons like this. You have to go to your save coupons and see which ones you have already clipped. Because when you search for it, the, your save ones will not show up. So that's why I have to go to coupons.com app to show you. So only clip the four off two and the two off one. And this was a thank you um, or just for you coupon. So it varies from, from account to account and remove all the rest of the ones that you have clipped before doing your deals so that it will not interfere with your transaction and that you know you want the four dollar and the two dollar off to come off not just the one dollar off to come off or you know that's that but um if you have the one dollar off clip like remove that like that will be like the worst one to come off that is that so i just wanted to let you guys know so that you know that's the same thing with dollar general and cvs as well make sure you clip the higher value coupon because if you have both the lower value and the higher value clip the lower value one will come off first and but for walgreens you have a way to remove them on your app or you know if you go to your desktop but it's i think it's easier to remove on the app than the desktop because I had like trouble finding it at on the desktop at walgreens.com so I recommend going to your app and going to your safe coupons and just removing the ones you're not going to use because it will interfere um and for CVS or Wal I mean CVS and Dollar General you have no way of removing them but to purchase the item. So for CVS and Dollar General, I will be very careful when I'm clipping such manufacturer coupons. Make sure to clip the higher value one first. And then, um, you know, if the low, if you plan on doing, you know, more than what you think you would, you could go back and check if you still have it. But the best thing to do is um, sometimes there are also printables on coupons.com. So just print out, you know, extra printables to take to the store so you could use you know one digital and then a bunch of other printables so that is it from me thanks for watching bye